Hello everybody and um, welcome, my name's Lynn, welcome to my channel Nana M. Um, it's my very first ever YouTube video and I've decided to do a Timu haul. I'm almost certain that 90% um, of people already know about Timu. It's, uh, but for those that don't, just in case, it's an online shopping site but there's also an app. And it's a little bit on the style of Amazon where you've got different sellers selling from one platform. And um, so you may well see the same item um, when you scroll down, um, you'll, you might see the same thing in a different place and it might be a different price as well, but it's usually only pennies. Um, so I decided, I love it, and I decided to jump on the Timu train and use it for my first video. It's not sponsored. Everything that you see that I show you today, I bought myself. So you're going to get a 100% honest review. Um, everything that I'm showing you, I've put a link to it in my description box down below. If you press more, it'll say description and then all the links will be down there. So you can just click on, if you see anything that you want to buy for yourself, and you haven't been on Timu before, you can just click that link and it should take you straight through to the page that sells that item. Um, normally I've had about, I would say about five orders now at this point. Um, I'm not, obviously I'm not gonna show you everything today. I'm gonna split them up into different, different hauls and different videos because I need to be mindful of how long the video is um, because I'm, I'm an avid YouTube watcher. Um, but if the video goes on for too long, I get fed up and I switch off. So I'm going to be mindful of that. Um, but yeah, the delivery usually comes within about two weeks. And um, it's free delivery. And they have a free returns policy within 90 days. And you can choose whether your money goes back on the um, payment that you chose to pay with. Or whether it goes into your... Timu credit balance and then you can spend it on something else but that's entirely down to you and you can choose which um, return option I, I use every but there's lots of other different ones on there as well that you can choose from um, it's really really easy to navigate I found it really good and when you get your emails or you can go on my orders and click on that and you can see all your orders exactly how much it was blah blah blah, blah. So if you fancy having a go, get yourself over there. Anyway, I love it and I'm possibly, I would say, just a little bit addicted, but never mind. So let's crack on. So I'll show you my first item. So my husband nearly every day has eggs for breakfast, eggs and toast. So just for a bit of fun, I decided to order four of these. So you pop that in your frying pan, pop your egg inside and you get that shaped egg. We haven't used them yet, obviously, because I wanted to show them on the haul first, but we'll be using those tomorrow. So there's a little daisy pattern. You get four. There's a heart shape. A circle. And a star. So that's just a little bit of fun. So those four were £1.98. So that's that. I'll do another kitchen one. I only have one butter knife and it's only really small. Now, I ordered this as a second butter knife because we have a caravan and I don't like, we've only recently got it. And it's only a little thing, but um, you know, we've decided that we want to go away in this country a little bit more in between going on holidays abroad but what i don't want to do is take things out of my kitchen and have to put them in the caravan i want the caravan to have its own utensils and i do like a butter knife so i thought i'd give this one a go i've never had a wooden one before but i ordered that and for reference it's that big and that was 98 pence so i thought i'd have a wooden one for a change so that's that same reason, just so that I can have, you know, um, utensils in the caravan. This was £1.29, pair of tongs. So, 
and for reference they're that big really small but good enough you know for caravan so £1.28 for that and then I like to bake um, and I like to do cakes you know sometimes like with a mousse in the middle or ice cream in the middle blah blah and you need like a silicone wrap thing to go around your cake tin to keep everything in place until it sets in the fridge and I've never had this before so I've ordered this it's a film I can't remember how many meters you get on it but it looks quite thick it looks like there's quite a bit on there and that was £1.79. So I thought that was reasonable. And then I ordered myself a set of three little sieves. I've only got a big sieve. And sometimes, like if you're just straining something in, out of a small pan, like a tin of peas or something like that, you don't you don't want to use your massive one. Or if you want to use baking, you know, um, icing sugar on something and sprinkle it so three of those for £2.69 they've all got a little hook so all those will go on the same hook in my kitchen underneath my big one and then they're all together so that's that £2.69 still on the kitchen theme I got this uh, microwave splatter bowl little handle what did I have the other day I think it might have been baked beans and they exploded oh, I'm mortified <laughs> can you imagine my microwave flipping heck so that's it's quite a big size actually that was £1.98 so that will save me a lot of cleaning not well then I got myself this silicone baking mat. I think it's 60 centimetres by 40, I think it is, this. So this is what you've got. So you've got all your circles in the middle, telling you how many inches they are. Centimetres at this side, inches at this. You've got um, a measure magnet. So that's like one cup equals eight ounces equals 16 teaspoons, blah, blah. At this side, you've got your temperature table. And then uh, across the top and down one side, you've got inches. And down the other side and across the bottom, you've got centimetres. So, I wanted one of those for ages, so I got one, and that was £3.59, so I'll roll that up proper later on. So that was that, oh, and I got um, some coin forks, um, 98 pence. sticking in your coin we don't have coin on the cob very often but I just fancied some and I thought well we haven't really got any so there you go now I think they're quite good though quite sturdy good sharp points on so you get two obviously in the pack 98p so I got two so that's that then what did I get to do with the kitchen? Really just cloths now. So this was a pack of two dishcloths. And they have a little hanging loop sewn in on the end. And there's two. Two for 98 pence. So that's it. I've got that break, that um, little edging round there. So that's that. Two of those. 
quite good. And I got, I've been seeing these on quite a few YouTubers channels where they do cleaning. And there's cold magic cloths and you get two in a packet for 97 pence and they're 40 by 50 centimetres. And apparently if you uh, wash your window or whatever with a, no, you only get one, sorry. You don't get two, you get one. That's why I bought two packets. Yeah, you just get one. If you clean your window and then dry off with one of these, apparently any kind of glass, stove top, whatever, street free. So I'm all for a little bit of street free. So I'm going to try those out. See how I go. So that's one for 97 pence. But like I say, it is a big one. 40 by 50 centimetres. So next time I clean my windows, or I might do it on my hob actually. Because I've got a glass one. So see how that goes. And then I bought myself this. Because I don't always want to use a big jug. When I'm baking, if something's just like 30 mil, whatever, this goes up to 100 mil. This little jug like that. Well, it's not a jug, it's, well, it has a spout, but yeah, it goes from 5 mil up to 100. So I got one of those. That was 98 pence. I love kitchen stuff. Then, I'm sure you've seen these. They're all over Facebook. They're everywhere. Food. You know, when you've got food left over and you put it in a dish and you want to put, you've got, you haven't got a lid, you use these. There's a hundred. A hundred in a pack. Yeah. For £1.48. So I'll just open one up for you. It's a bit like a shower cap, if you will. But it's for over your bowl. So you just put that over your bowl, cover your food up before you put it in the fridge. If you want to leave something out, don't want flies to get on. Ideal. 148 for 100. That's that. And I think that is everything to do with kitchen. So now I'll show you this. Like I say, we go away uh, occasionally and um, there's been lots of times when uh, there's been no rain while we've been away and when I come back and all my flowers are withered. Plants, sometimes they, they're actually dead. So I don't like bothering anybody and asking somebody else to come and water them while we're away. So I got these. Now these, are, I got, you can get them in a pack of five or a pack of 10. I got 10 for £3.47. And what you do is you save some screw top water bottles, plastic obviously. So can you see there's a hole there? Where is it? Can you see it? There, a hole, yeah. And then you've got this little number and this part goes through the hole like that then this part goes on the top of the bottle that you've saved that you've filled with water you turn it over because it screws in and some push in as well and then you put this in your soil around the bottom of your plant and this little thing here regulates the drop that comes out of here so hopefully if i'm just away for a few days that'll keep my plants alive while i'm away because it'll just drip 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 until the bottle's empty so obviously the bigger the bottle the longer you can go away for so i'll give the hook a try and see see how that works i love stuff like this 10 £3.47. Then, another thing in the caravan, the quilt keeps moving inside the cover. 
drives me insane. Absolutely drives me bonkers. So I bought these. You get four in a pack for one pound nine p. And I'll just show you this. Can you see? There's a little button there. So you press that button and this pin comes out. Let go. Push it through your, your, your cover, your duvet, out the other side, in there. And that holds it. And it holds the four corners of your duvet so that it, you don't lose your corners. Even if I only use this for putting my duvet covers back on when I've done my washing. God, that's a job I don't like doing it. I hate it. But that drives me mad in the caravan. My duvet's come up here and corners down there and there's no duvet in it. So, I got four in a pack. I got two packs and each pack was £1.49. So, I'm going to give those a try. Gadgets. My husband thinks I'm bonkers. Now then, I have a granddaughter and she's two. She was two in February. And sometimes she gets a bit giddy and starts to run. And I have to say, Ida, she's called Ida, bless her. And I'll say, because I have a coffee table that's got really sharp corners and I have um, quartz worktop. Now, when we had this put in, we had this put in with, with grandchildren in mind and we had the corners rounded off. So these aren't square corners, they're rounded off. You'd still hurt yourself if you banged yourself, but at least they're rounded off and they're not a point. But my coffee table's four corners are a point. So I bought these and it's a set of four for 98p. And can you see? They're like a silicone shock absorber type thing. And they've got three sticky pads. So what you would do is, Peel off the sticky pads and put that on your corner, like that. So if she does happen to run about and catch herself, at least she's not catching the corner. So that's what that's for, for my little Ida. Love that child more than life itself. Then, I got um uh, I do do crafts occasionally, uh, including sewing. Nothing major, just alterations or I'm only five foot one. So if I buy pants, even if I get petite, generally speaking I've got to take them up. I nearly always have to take dresses up. Well, nine times out of ten anyway. So um and I've got a pin cushion and I've had needles, needles, needles over the years. And I think they must go inside because sometimes I can't find them. So I bought myself, I think they're 16 and they're only 39p. Gold top, all different sizes. So I got myself those. 16 for 39p. Can't go wrong. Also, I got, for going away again, this, I have a... Um, I have uh, tablets every day. Um, I take two in the morning and three at night. I may have one of those Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, a.m., p.m. But it's too big and it's a bit flimsy. So just for going away on holiday, I bought myself this. So this is a pill organiser. So it's got eight compartments. So these two are quite big at the top. So I thought I'd be able to, even even quite big tablets, I'd be able to get in there. So if I go away for two weeks, I can put my tablets inside there. And then there's the six ones at the bottom for the smaller tablets. And I can get, I think, enough tablets in there for 14 days. So rather than take my plastic one, the, the, the lids keep coming open. Taking that, so I'm gonna give that a go. I'm gonna give it a whirl. It's quite quite sturdy that. It's hard plastic. So that's what that is. And that was one pound ninety-eight. So I haven't brought the bank if it doesn't work, have I really? Then I've got these. I'm sure it, 
there's a lot of ladies in the same predic well it's not a predicament really um when you're using your hair dryer or your straighteners what do you do with your wire after you have to wait for it to cool down don't you then i, I don't know about you but it's round the, the top round the handle round the top round the handle wind 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 so i bought myself a pack of these one pound 48 for three and you get the, these double-sided sticky tape that sticks on this piece then this side peel that off that sticks on your appliance or somewhere near your appliance if you you know if you don't want it on your appliance and then you wrap your wire around round 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 and then you put the end of the wire with the plug in through that bit keeps everything tidy i'm all for tidy all for tidy and organized you drive me mad, don't you, like when you're just dangling everywhere. Well, they do me anyway, so that's that. Then I got myself one of these. £1.47 this was. And it's a lint roller. But it's not, you know, the I can't find, I can never find the end. Um, you know the ones you buy and you have to pull back once you've used them to the, and rip it off to the next piece. I can never find the end. Drives me mad. What things do be driving me mad? <laughs> I don't really. I'm not that bad. Why I keep saying that? I don't know. Anyway, this. Well, I put it in there because it's so sticky. It sticks to everything. One pound. Oh look, it's stuck to that. Get it off. And it's a lint roller. So like that. But then. You can wash this under the tap and then you reuse it. So that to me sounds perfect. So and it works. I've tried it. I've tried it. But I'm keeping it in here because it just sticks to everything. So that's why that is in that zipper bag. It's even sticking to that. So you can see that that, that definitely works. Good. Then I got myself, I'm always pruning things, so these are like little garden shears and they're only £1.59 and they do feel really good quality. So you move that back down, look. So when I'm pruning my roses, or anything else, sweet peas, rhubarb, I'm going rhubarb. And then you click it back to hold it in. Oh, it won't go back. Oh, what have I done? It did, it did, it's me. Okay, so I thought they were pretty good, one pound fifty-nine. I'm sure you'd, you'd pay about a fiver, wouldn't you, in a garden shop for them? Easy, a fiver. This is what I'm saying about Timu, you know, you just, if you want to buy something, just check it out first, because you might get it a lot cheaper on Timu than you'll get it anywhere else. That's what I've found anyway. So, so I'm going to move on now. Oh, this. This was <laughs> £3.25. I mean, I said, when I clicked on it to buy it and put it in my cart, it looked a lot bigger than this. And I thought, my little Ida's going to love this. She does love it, actually. She has toys that she plays with here when she comes to Nana's house. Um, and she leaves them here. Um, and very often she'll have a nap. And this is supposed to be like a pillow. And she did put her head on it and she did, she did like it, so... That's Mr. Goose. <laughs> and Mr. Goose was £3.27. For Ida. And then I got myself some. I've forgotten another household thing. 
these come in a pack of four for £2.48. I got two packs. See that? Why did you only get two when I've got three stools anyway? I think I need to try them out. So they go on the bottom of the leg of your stool or your, whatever, your chair, whatever it is you want to put them on. And they've got this felt pad on the bottom. They're like a silicone. Like that. When we ordered these stools, I'll show them you at some point. We ordered worktop size stools, not bar stools, because we we sit at worktop height on the other side of of here. Let me show you. That's all my team is stuff. Can you see? And we've got three bar stools there. Oh, I can't do it with a camera. So we didn't want obviously bar stools because we'd have been up here trying to eat or whatever it is we're doing. So we ordered worktop height stools. When they came, they were bar stools. Oh, we were so disappointed. Anyway, my husband's a joiner and he won't be beaten with any of these. He said, I'm going to chop them off. I'm going to make them the size I want them to be. And I thought he's never going to get them level in a million years. But he did. But obviously the bottom, you know, I mean, he sanded them off and everything. So I got them to go on the bottom. See what they do. So that's the felt. So they won't scratch the wooden floor. So I'll try those out. They were large for my bar stools. I think they do small, medium and large. So that was that. Then I got myself some elastic laces because I do like to wear trainers and the trainers that I have most of them have the shoelace and then you've got to tie a bow or if you don't want a bow you have to push them in and shove them down the side of your feet and that, that, it's just uncomfortable for me is that so for the trainers that I'm thinking of I'm going to take the shoelaces out that are in and I'm going to put these in and they're elastic and you thread them through Cut them off to the desired length, just so that they just meet at the top where the tongue of your trainer is. And then you put these ends in. You feed them through and put these ends in. So they just sit then on the front of your trainer so you don't have a ball. And you don't have to shove the excess down the side of your feet and be uncomfortable. So that's what those are for. But they haven't put them in yet because I wanted to show them to you. So that's what they are. Then, as well as that, I got myself this. This was £2.19. Because mine, I've got one, obviously, already. I've got two, actually. But one of them, the elastic's going here. It's elastic here. So... I bought myself a new one. Head wrap, towel wrap for your head when you've washed your shampoo your hair. So that's a new one of those to go with the other one. And then the one that's elastic's gone can get thrown away. Or I'll put one in the caravan. That's what I'll do with that. £2.19. Did I say? Yeah, £2.19. So then. I wanted a shower cap, so I got two different kinds. I got this one, £1.47. So that's all gathered there. With that nice broad rim round. So I'll put one in the caravan and keep one in the house. That was £1.47. And this one was £1.48. I'll probably keep that at home, that one. Shower cap, it's double layered, so it's quite good quality actually. Yeah, £1.48. So that's that. Now, this video is nearly 30 minutes long, so I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna wrap it up here. 
and show you these other bits on a different hole because I've been on for far too long now. So we're going to leave it at that. So I'd like to say thank you for joining me today. Thank you for spending some of your precious time. And um, if you wouldn't mind giving me a thumbs up, leave a comment, uh, subscribe if you would. That's how apparently, it, well, that's how your channel grows. Um, and obviously when you first start out, you need the help you can get. So please subscribe. And if you do, if you hit the notification bell, um, that will tell you every time I upload a new video. So once again, thank you for watching and wait for the next one. Bye. Bye.